Now to a strain of cockroach, which has evolved to outsmart the sugar traps that are used to kill them. They're geniuses, these Scotch cockroaches. Scientists in the US found that these mutant cockroaches has reorganised their sense of taste, making them dislike the flavour of sweet glucose, which is used to coat poisoned bait. Very clever. Here's our science reporter, Victoria Gill. A cockroach being offered a dose of sugar solution in what must be the world's smallest taste test. And the insects' reactions have revealed a trick they've evolved to evade our attempts to catch and kill them. The cockroaches on the right have developed a disliking for a specific sugar, glucose. That's why in these experiments the hungry pests reject the glucose-rich jam but swarm all over the peanut butter. This change in their sense of taste came about less than a decade after pest controllers started using glucose to sugarcoat poisoned bait they put down in people's homes. Housed here in the collections at London's Natural History Museum are about a third of the 4,600 species of cockroach in the world. Only about 30 of those species are the kitchen pests we know so well. This experiment shows just how quickly those pests adapt to evade the chemical weapons that we throw at them. This slow motion footage shows this adaptation in detail. When the cockroach is offered glucose, it shakes its head, and if you look closely, you can even see it spit the liquid out. The scientists were actually able to record the activity of the cockroach's taste cells, the equivalent of their taste buds, demonstrating that to these mutant cockroaches, the once sweet flavor of glucose now tastes very bitter. It's certainly interesting that they've developed an aversion to a food substance, but it's not very surprising because it's part of a poison and it's just another example of natural selection in action which is happening all the time. For instance, um, drug resistance in diseases, warfarin resistance in rats. For now, it seems that cockroaches have just won one battle in their evolutionary arms race against us.